That boy is funny shit. What you making me? Get his ass. Get his ass. Put that bitch on his head. Put that bitch on his head. Fuck him. Put that bitch on his head. Come on, man. Man, he got a grown ass man pouring drinks on homeless people and giggling about it. Y'all know this man is like 30 years old. Like, this is what we talk about women that don't be having daddies in their life and how they be acting like they got daddy issues. This is exactly what happens when you got daddy issues as a grown ass man. You do stupid shit like this. This is shit we was doing when we was 13, not 30. Y'all understand me? This is a grown ass man we're talking about. And then, you know, it being an older man, it just shows there's no respect for your elders, your OGs, your old heads, none of that. And then, you know, you got niggas in the background, you know, egging it on and shit like that. Like, nah, this shit ain't cool. And the crazy part is, not too long ago, just a couple days ago, we was just talking about you boo-booing on yourself. Where's Gangsta Licious? Say that again, I couldn't hear you over the sound of me shitting myself. Like, we was just talking about how niggas caught you slipping, which can happen to anybody, but then, you know, the embarrassing part is you shitting yourself, it's been making this rounds, and you would've think that you would've calmed down from it, but you did the exact opposite and did some more dumb shit to grab attention. You know what I mean? Like, and just think about it, not too long ago, he was in Chicago and he got shot and he lost his voice for a minute. You know, he just got out of jail uh, a couple months ago, I wanna say. You would think that with those experiences, it would have humbled you as a person, like losing your ability to talk, to speak, and then finally being able to get it back after so long and doing whatever little time you did in jail, whatever the case may be recently, but nope, no lesson learned. You just keep doing the same dumb shit over and over till we get shot again, then it's RIP, he didn't deserve it. Now, I don't want to see nothing bad happen to Lil Reese. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was glad when he got his voice back. I was like, damn. I heard he got hit. You know, I was hoping, you know, he'd get his vocals back. I actually like this verse on uh, Distance with Lil Dirk. I'm not familiar with his music, but, you know, I heard the project he did with Dirk. And, you know, since then, I ain't really heard nothing from him on the music side. All I see is interviews. So, you know. Maybe you need to get back to making music and start with the annex. But anyway, let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Y'all feel like he tripping or you feel like this is somehow justified. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe. 